I'm Pat Gunn, and we're playing Skyrim. And what we're doing right now is we are heading down to, uh, oh, where was it? Well, it's somewhere down here. We're heading down to transcribe the lexicon and hopefully pick up an Elder Scroll. So, let's get to it. Actually, I'm wondering if it might be easier for me to take the Great Elevator down rather than the main entrance, because I already cleared the uh, main entrance some time back. We'll have to see what the map says when we make it down here. Hmm, neat bottle shapes there. So I wonder, with these bottles, like the the big bulky chest-like ones that have the spigot on top, are those, uh, well, in any case, let's see. So the game is suggesting, okay, transcribing the lexicon, is that in the current area? Well, in the overhead map it seems to be. Uh, and actually it seems to suggest that on the mini-map it's nearby. Transcribe the lexicon. I wonder if it's just trying to point me in a weird way at the uh, dwarven mechanism or if I'm supposed to do something more on this stand. Am I missing something here? How does transcribing the lexicon work? And I guess the game hasn't actually cleared out the bodies uh, down here, which is kind of interesting. Uh, where, what am I doing here? Oh, now that thing is gone from... Well... I guess maybe when I make my way down to, down into Black Run, or Black Reach, uh, I'll see if it tells me to turn around. It's possible that I've glitched out the lexicon and won't be able to do that quest. I'm hoping that isn't the case. Okay, so we are back in Blackreach. Back in... Okay, that suggests the exit. Not getting any suggestions for... Okay, so now transcribing the lexicon is a good ways southwest of here. Southwest. Well, I guess that's a sign that... Oh. Ah, shoot it. Oh, that was not the shot that I meant to use. I was going to summon my buddy Dunavir, but... So where... I am seeing a red light somewhere up and to the right. But it's unclear where it actually is. I don't think that there's anything up. Is there anything down? No. Well, it doesn't really matter. Where I'm heading is, again, a good ways southwest of here. Well, actually, it's possible that transcribing the lexicon happens at the same place that I uh, take care of the Elder Scroll. Possible. I don't quite remember this area that well. But I'll just uh, head off in that direction. 
I guess is roughly this way. Uh, might as well. Okay. That sounds like... Ooh! A Thalmer. Somewhere down here. So I already killed the dragon who lives in this area, which, if you'll remember right, was summoned by shouting at the giant disco ball. Incidentally, I would not recommend trying that at, at nightclubs, you'll get kicked out. Okay, yeah, getting closer, a little bit west, a good way south. Keep on moving. Yeah, I really love the way that this this place is put together. Maybe it's that tower, the really tall one up ahead. I'm not sure if I've been to this uh, this part before. Let's see. How am I doing? I am getting very close to it. I'm just. Cool. So I think it is this tower. That's probably where I want to be. And this will lead me up into the Tower of Mazark. This is looking like where the uh, where the older scroll is. So I guess maybe I take care of both of those at the same time. Let's see, is there anything I want up here? Uh, two scrolls. They're not all that useful. Maybe a little bit left of center. Yep, looking good. Yeah, this is this is the uh, where the Elder Scroll is. I'm pretty sure there aren't any foes up here, so I'll put my weapon away. Here we go. So, in order to make this work, I put in the lexicon receptacle. Uh, receptacle? Yeah, receptacle. I need to rotate this into the right position. Now, let's see. Still don't quite have this right. Okay, that there we go. Um, let's get these positioned appropriately. Also not quite right. And now we activate this. Looking good. Now we can grab that since we're done with it, and we want to head up and grab the Elder Scroll. So now we actually have all three Elder Scrolls that are in the game, and we can we can take the elevator back up to the surface. So having the Elder Scrolls opens up two quest lines, uh, as I mentioned. 
Well, actually, having completed that area, we have the ruined lexicon, which we want to take back to Septimus, who's a deranged wizard living a little bit north of the College of Winterhold. And now we can uh, work on the dragon quest. Okay, so let's open the lever and we're going to head, let's head up to talk to Septimus. Now the reason I like to talk to Septimus first is that his quest, the next step in his quest involves a lot of fairly slow effort to do stuff. It's, it's not the kind of thing where you, you're easily going to be able to do it all at once. So it's just uh, best just to take it um, so that you can accomplish it little by little with no devoted effort. So let's head back down to talk with him. Hop. Hop. Good. The top left. Give it quickly. Extraordinary. The ceilings. Dwemer blood can look a panoply of their breath. The blood of Altmer, Bosmer, Dunmer, Falmer, and Orsimer. The elves still living provide the key. Bear you hence this extractor. It will drink the fresh blood of elves. Come when it set is complete. Okay, so th that's what I mean. We, we need to collect the blood of the various types of uh, elves in the game. And it's hard to just go and find enough of the right elves uh, in, uh, in one devoted effort. But you will encounter dead elves throughout the game, so... Cool voice, this guy. Most impressive. Your continuing aid to Septimus renders him increasingly obsolete. He has served me well, but his time is nearing its end. Once that infernal lockbox. He will have exhausted his usefulness to me. When that time comes, you shall take his place as my emissary. What say you? Indeed, speak with me when the box has been opened and all shall be revealed. Okay. So that was another Daedric Prince. I think the Daedric Prince of Secrets. Okay, so we have this new quest to gather a whole lot of different kinds of blood, which we're just going to do accidentally as we play the game. Um, what else do we have to do? We have a whole bunch of, of, of quests, one of which involves... Huh, that wasn't where I thought Medesi was. Where was it? Bring the Flawless... I thought Medesi was in Riften. Maybe he is in Riften. I'm kind of fond of him as a character. And actually, I'm, I also would like at this point to be able to adopt children uh, for my house now that I have a, um, a steward and a house carl and a bard. 
Although I still feel a little bit bad that my character isn't going to be the one to contributing to raising them. Although I can feel a little bit less bad about that, imagining that after retiring, provided that my character survives, uh, that will happen. <clears throat> But yeah, I'm, I'm going to return to Riften. Uh, I think Medesi is the jeweler, uh, the Argonian who lives in the or who has a stall in the sales area, and I, I can give him the, the jewels. I can talk to the uh, um, the orphan house about adopting. I'm not sure if I have to adopt them or not. been looking for you. Oh. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Oh, wait. Here. There's a fight. Stop. Stop. He's let me... Uh, let me go. Like that's it. Got to go. Okay. That's nice. There's a thief there. Yeah, that's a sad thing. I'm the leader of the Thieves Guild, but... Oh no, Medesi died. Well, that sucks. Oh, a vampire and a thief at the same time. Great. Well... Grab some vampire dandruff. A dead guard. Where is Medesi? Great. Divine smile on you. Oh yeah, there's a ruby here. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not fast enough to stop. I wasn't fast enough to stop the slaughter. And it looks like Grelka died. I think she was the person who ran the stand here. Well, that that really sucks. I've been gathering these. Where, where is Medesi? Um. Nope. Sorry. Nothing. And yeah, that's that's one of the really really irritating things in the game. That. Um. That whenever you visit a town, it's reasonably likely that. That somebody will show up and kill a lot of the people there. Your skin's as pale as the snow. Scared of sunlight or something? Darn it, where is Medesi? Because if I find him, I, won't, I wouldn't mind resurrecting him. But it's a, a lot easier to do that without, or when I can find his corpse. Oh, there's Medesi. Okay, so Medesi. Or yes, no, maybe. Get up, dude. Maybe I should. No, don't get in the way, Serana. Okay, let's pick him up if I can. Okay, come on, dude. No, I did not mean to loot that. Move! No! Move, Serana! Jeez. Huh, Medesi is apparently pretty heavy. Okay, so... Is he stuck in the ground somehow? He might be a little bit stuck in the ground. Come on, get up. Okay. Let's do this the other way. Oh, no, that wasn't helpful. Uh, get up, dude. Um, so I... I seem to be having much difficulty with bringing Medesi back to life. Uh... 
Well, Enjoy. then stop. Don't stand right in my way, dude. So let's do it this way. Unselect him. Uh, does that not work? So I can slide him kind of along the ground like this. Can I lift him up out of it? Oh. What happened? Can I really not lift him up? Come on. It stop. Can pull him upwards. But yeah, he does seem to be pretty well stuck in. Oh, the dog is in the way. Get out of here, dog. Oh, come on. Maybe if I drag him part way. Because <laughs> that just looks wrong. Apart from not being helpful in bringing him back to life. Dragging him through the dock, perhaps. I don't want to drop him, but maybe. Yeah, if I can drag him to the stairs. Maybe he can be freed of being stuck in the ground by being pulled out to where there's no ground to be stuck in. Oh no, that was not what I meant to happen. And, well, he's at least in the water now. Okay, let's try this now. You're still dead. Why is it not working? I guess, as I said, I don't mind resurrecting NPCs. I wouldn't want to do it with the Master Vampire, but it, should, it really shouldn't be this hard. If I do it on a Riften Guard, how does it... So I couldn't properly teleport myself to where he was. The game seemed to get confused. On the other hand, after NPCs are dead for a little bit, they, um, whoa, am I? OK, the game seems to think I'm underwater now. That's funny. Uh, stepping outside fixed it. Uh, he will be transported to the uh, Hall of the Dead, and once that's done, I should be able to probably retrieve him from there and bring him back to life. But I, I'm... Why am I... Oh, now I can bring you back to life. Okay.
Okay, well, I guess I, I won't keep on trying to do that. That's not working out so well. But there were two reasons that I came here. What was the other one? Oh, yeah, I want to talk to somebody about adoption. Or Medesi. Or is it Madesi? I'm guessing it's Medesi. Okay, so I realize that it is late, but I am curious how adoption works. This war has created so many orphans. Yes, of where will your child be living? Very well. That's all I need from you. Congratulations. Go meet the... Ch Once you've made a decision, I'll collect their things and be sure they make it over to your house. Cool. And now you're probably going to go back to bed. I'm curious what this skill book is. Oh, it's pickpocketing. Not all that useful and unusual reading for you. And... Yeah, it is really cool that Serana interacts uh, a lot with your um, with the surroundings. Actually, I'm wondering if I can summon Medesi. Well, except would that make a new version of him? Move to play. Console moves in mysterious ways. Nope. Sorry. Nothing. Oh yeah, so what did I get from the courier? I got oh, I didn't want to bring up the map. I want items, books. I don't think that was it. Uh, this probably wasn't it either. Okay, so that's in Windhelm. It's another uh, another gathering random chunk uh, quest. So let's head up and uh, do that. What else is there to do? Oh. Okay, so we're heading to the alchemy shop over here. They 
the gods watch over your battle. So much from him. I'll never have mastered Aurelian skills. Good to hear. You can be a difficult woman to find. Thankfully, those. C I have some thoughts. On the top of the throat of the world is a patch of un. Then we need the tusk of a mammoth. The final step is tricky. If you can bring me these materials, the file can again be made whole. Okay, that works for me. The ivory produced by those. They're able to grind a de the finished material as the delicate. The final temp the nearest with the heart of one of them. It's difficult to explain to the layman. On top of the throat, they say, the graybeards, the original file was made from this snow. We'll only need a small bit for the repairs. Okay, that works. So, let's uh, activate this. I have a decent mind for Ah, so you're an alchemist. So what do you have? Mm, well, that gives us a little bit of progress. Always happy to see that. I'd better get going. I had expected. Okay, so that's that. Oh yeah, there's also somebody up here. Okay, a little bit to the left and slightly forward. I lost my twin sister. Poor Nip. Those boots aren't place. worth the septums I do pay them. I'm not giving them coin I could give to easy. Maybe I was being too harsh on them. By the honor of Clan Shattershield, they will be paid fairly. Okay. I do like that I can advance the rights of workers in a game where neither the uh, the workers nor the um, owners are real. Oh, hey. Hi, lady. Would you like to buy some flowers? Not much, but I hope you like them. Uh, sure. I don't need flower baskets, but the rest was nice. They're, they're dead. My mama died when I was little. My father was a storm cloak soldier. I'm all alone. I, I tried to sell flower. Really? Do you? Oh, wow. Yay! Thanks, mama. I promise I'll be the best daughter ever. It's so bright out here. Cool. I uh, wasn't meaning to do that, but uh, I hope you can make it to my place okay. Uh, I need to get my things and say goodbye to everyone. I'll meet you at home. Thanks. Thanks so much. That's actually kind of uh, heartwarming. Um, wow. Okay. Uh, well. Let's also head down and let the dock workers know that I've uh, helped with their um, with their negotiations. I'm actually kind of unexpectedly touched by. Uh, anyhow, so let's. Uh, is that okay? Doesn't seem like a very fun kind of thing to be holding. <sighs> okay, so. Kind of weird clothy thing there.
Oh, looks like he is still hanging out where the Argonians hang out. So I will wait for him to step outside. Is he still in there? Yeah, I guess he is. How about now? Still? Okay, well, let's wait till tomorrow then. Not sure what his sleep schedule is like. Okay, so you're still in there. One one hour. Another hour. Let's move faster. The sun is. That's not great for my skin. I'm a vampire too. I fully understand what you mean. Oh, come on. Get out of there. It's noon now. Is he still in there? This is ridiculous. Okay, that's fine. I'm just going in. Whoop. Apparently... You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? Everything here appears to be in order. You can move along now. The Nords don't appreciate. Look, we don't have much love for your kind down here. Why is Medesi just hanging out in the uh isn't very friendly? Are you Medesi? Or not Medesi. Uh, who, who am I looking for? I'm looking for Scub's Many Marshes. Why are you not coming outside? Oh, come on. Okay. We've waited for more than 24 hours. I'm just going in. And you'll notice I'm ducking down, which... Sometimes, if your sneak is high enough, then it will protect you from... It'll protect you from being noticed while you're picking a lock. I think when you're standing, it's just assumed that you're not even trying to do it uh, surreptitiously. You're not supposed to be here. I know, but I'm looking for... Last time I'll say it. You're not supposed to be here. Well, let's see if I can slip you outside by having you talk while I use the door. Okay, did that do it? No. I heard some of the sailors talk. Thank you. I'll be waiting for that bottle. Okay. And used to get you talked to. Here I was saving this for a rainy day. Maybe now I can afford a few more for my people. If you take it, may the earth beneath your feet be always sweet. So I managed to yank them outside through uh, slightly sneaky means. Okay, so now we can head, head up to the throat of the world and Is this the third of the world? You have it. The Kel, the Elder Scroll, Tidkrech, Kalos. Time shudders at its touch. Yep, so where is the wavery place? Aha. Uh -huh. 
very bones of the earth are at your disposal. Okay, this feels like the right place to read this thing. Now, I am going to note that this is a glitchy event. So, uh, I generally like to save the game first. It's also worth noting that this is a cutscene that you have no control over. So, I'm hoping that there will be a time for this within, uh, within this run. But I honor your courage, Kriegwolf Akrin. Die now in vain. So this apparently happened at a time in the past when the, the dragons mostly ruled uh, mortals with the aid of dragon priests and the people have an ins insurrection Yeah, a bunch of humans started fighting the dragons But Alduin, the leader of the dragons, what else is there? Um, he still has to, uh, people have to figure out how to deal with him. I fear all may be lost. You worry too much, brother. Victory will be ours. So you can see that the word wall over there, uh, it's complete back in this time. He will come. He cannot ignore our defiance. And why should he fear us even now? We blooded him well. Four of his kin have fallen to my blade alone. But none have yet stood against Aldo and himself. Both Sori, Birka. They did not have Dragon Red. Once we bring him down, I promise I will have his. Yeah. So to remind you, Parthenax taught uh, taught some humans the Thum. He is beyond our strength. And um. And these guys are Parthenax's buds. I never agreed. And if you are right, I will not need it. We will deal with Alduin ourselves. Hear it now. We shall see soon enough. Alduin approaches. Okay, so this is where the game sometimes glitches out. Sometimes Alduin fails to show up. And I'm hoping that he will show up here. Uh, maybe? Is that Alduin? I'm hoping it's Alduin. Okay. So this is beginning to look like it's not a working... Uh, yeah, Skyrim does have some major bugs. This is definitely an instance where it doesn't seem like uh, we're, we're going to see anything more. I think, yeah, we would have seen something by now if this hadn't gotten stuck. So I'm going to reload the game from a save I took just before reading the scroll. Yeah, but I find it helps to uh, to do some other quests in between bef uh, between your attempts to get this working. So I'm going to head up to Kessel Volokar and have my Moth Priest uh, read the Elder Scrolls, and hopefully we'll have a little bit more luck the next time. But what I'm going to try to do is actually... Um, and one of these let's plays uh, where I'm in a position to try to um, try to read the scroll and that way if I fail I can just uh, not show you guys the probably boring repetitive attempts to uh, get through that cinematic scene 
and I can only show you the successful one hopefully it's possible I might need to use the console to uh, skip past that part which would be unfortunate because it is a pretty cool cutscene well I guess cutscene is probably the wrong word uh, it's a pretty cool scripted event but if the scripts aren't going to behave for us then there's not a lot I can do about it I've had this this particular uh, bug show up maybe half of the time that I've done um, maybe half of uh, with half of the characters that I've um, I've had in Skyrim. Actually, there's kind of a counterpart bug in the uh, in the war quest line that can prevent you from finishing that. So for those unfortunate people who make a character who can't complete either quest line, they're kind of SOL for for um, for the game. Okay, so he's been waiting here. Don't oh no, that's not him. And I won't tear your arms off. Simple, isn't it? Okay, so where is Dexian? Okay, he's a little bit to the right somewhere. Is he up here? Oh, he's doing some yes. chemistry. How may I serve you, milady? I am afraid I won't be able to help you with the scrolls any longer, milady. Please do not be angry with me. I'm afraid in my haste to read the first scroll, I neglected the time I needed to prepare. As you can see from my bandages, it's not that I am unwilling, it's that I am physically unable. Wouldn't alchemy be kind of a dangerous thing? Oh, please, milady. Please, when you're blind? If only such a miracle existed, I'd overcome the impossible, although I would gladly die by your hand. Oh, thank you, milady. Scattered across Tamriel are secluded locations known only as ancestors. Performing the ritual of the ancestor moth with it, it involves carefully removing the bark from a... Once enough of the moths are following, they'll provide you with the second sight. In keeping with tradition, you must use a... Every moth priest is taught this ritual. From what I saw in the vision, the Elder Scroll which foreshadows the defiance of the gods with the blood of mortals is the key to the prophecy. Okay. Deciphering one, it can take months or even... Well, as I'm sure, the voice of the ancestor moth has always been in... Oh, the moths don't literally... If you listen closely, when you... it's through this ancestor... By having the ancestor moths, only the most resilient of priests can do it this way. You've come this way, whether you believe it or not. Because of this, I strongly believe you were meant to hear the ancestral chorus. Sadly, yes. It generally does not occur until a moth priest is in his latter years. But in my case, I simply was not preparing myself properly. Deciphering it can take months or even years to complete a single scroll and even then months to recover okay so that's that so i have a new quest that should let me read the elder scrolls and um so I think I'm going to end this walkthrough uh, back at the Throat of the World so that hopefully I'll be able to get a recording starting with that cutscene that will take us all the way through it. Hopefully. Okay, so we are going to activate that quest. Um, but we're going to head back up to the throat of the world. It's worth noting that for those of you who like uh, cute references to other video games, if you scout around the throat of the world a little bit and don't mind uh, 
climbing up and down places that are not the easiest places to tr uh, travel around. You will find a cute uh, object that's a reference to another video game. So it's worth making the effort if you can, uh, if you like that kind of thing. I think I'd prefer to leave that as something that I'm uh, not going to spoil. Uh, spoil you on. So there's a patch of unmelting ice that I need for that alchemy quest. And I guess it is... Oh. Okay, it is up here. And... And here I am at the... At the time wound thing. And I'm going to save the game, and I will see you in the next Let's Play.